patrons of a landlord and Great Day Property Management. Today I am at our house at 19143 Fairport and this is a really pretty neighborhood and right now I am looking at a police car that's looking at me. <laughs> it's parked in the neighborhood which I like to see police around. I think that's a good sign. Detroit's coming back. There's more police but I think they're really suspicious of me. <laughs> It wouldn't be the first time, I guess, that I act suspiciously. I don't know. Are you crazy? Are you crazy? So this is our house. And I wanted you to see this pretty brick street and this beautiful tree on a gorgeous fall day here in Detroit. I think that's the police right there. <laughs> so I'm gonna go in and show you the inside. Where you enter there's the front door you could go into the kitchen but i want you to see got a ceiling fan and this beautiful fireplace and these beautiful hardwood floors and it smells so good and clean in here our guy lo cleaned this one he does a really nice job and here's the kitchen with new cabinets and there's plenty of space for a diner uh, you know a dinette area right there and here is the bathroom. Not once have I ever heard an actual good, reasonable reason for people to shower. One of the colors that you get in Detroit. And the toilet lids down, that makes me happy. And the tub, these are, this is one of those original tubs. They did a really nice job getting that white. Um, they are really spacious and huge. I think when you buy new tubs, they're, they always seem to be, oh, there I am, <laughs> They're always small. And that's the shelf for the uh, telephone. A hundred years ago? Yeah, it doesn't even have no FaceTime. And here's the back, here's the bedroom back here. And another one over here. Looking out to the backyard, there's a one car garage. Let's check out one of the closets. Nice shelves up there, not bad. We'll go upstairs next. It looks fantastic. Uh, here is the upstairs bedroom. Oops, I wish I turned on the light. Um, look at that, this is an interesting one. Somebody built this in with the cupboards up there. You know, I think that's kind of cool. Here's good closet space. That's. That's always a hard thing to find in Detroit, but I think that's good in there. And here, which is beside, let's see if I can get the light on. Oh, I got that light on. So this is that closet that goes out to the stairs with little shelves there. And look at that, a built-in dresser. I think that's so nice. And then all this shelf space, I would personally have that all filled with books. <laughs> we'll go to the basement next. I'm going downstairs. More nice carpet here. Nice open space. And there's a nice, oh my gosh, I forgot this had a half bath. That is so cool. A nice one, nice shelving there. And oh, for a minute there, I thought it was a laundry chute, but it's not. And then a separate room here, which is always nice. When we bought this room, it was a grow room, or bought this house, <laughs> it was a grow room. Not anymore. Hijo de la chingada. Is that a joint, man? <laughs> and then we've got this space over here. I don't know what's in here. See that? Pretty good. I just gotta say, I got my drama-free move-in today. Everything was perfect. The house was clean, everything was ready. The tenant showed up a half hour early. I was so happy. Her kids were so sweet and fun and cute. I got some pictures of them all, so yay. She's happy, I'm happy, everybody's happy. 